Wagwan. Peace and blessings. Peace and blessings. Wagwan. Wagwan. So, today, I'm doing a challenge. I am not. Let me take my shirt off. I'm not flexible. There we go. Wagwan. 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 So today I'm going to be doing a challenge and the challenge I'm going to be doing is not going on social media platforms including YouTube for the entire 24 hour period of today. So right now it's about about to be 12 p.m. So until tomorrow, like I'm going to go longer than that. But the challenge is for sure we are not using any social media platforms till tomorrow and we're going to see how. We are affected. We're going to see what changes in our routine and the things that we do and all of those types of things. You understand what I'm saying? So, I'm not going to be on any platforms. I am going to be, however, posting content on YouTube, but I've already done that. Um, this video is probably not going to go out today. Who knows? So, all the only things I can do is post content to YouTube because that's not really like watching content if it's my own content. So I can only post content to YouTube and check my phone for if someone texts me, um, like my close friends or family members and calls and also homework. But for my homework, I'm gonna be doing it on my laptop and uh, seeing how it goes that way. So yeah, that's gonna be our challenge for the day. I'm just gonna be documenting this and actually like doing a study for us seeing you know, am I more productive? Am I less productive? What exactly goes on? You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Everything you've been wanting, man, manifesting for your life. Everything you've been wanting, man, manifesting for your life. Everything you've been wanting, man, manifesting for your life. Everything you want wanting, man, you best thing for me on that. So, yeah. Also, my legs are dead. We're going to see what I do for uh, activity today. But it's giving rest day because... There we go. It's giving rest day because my back actually hurts. So, we're going to see. I forgot this thing has active track. Like, I don't got to even worry about the works tracking. But anyways. So, right now, um, the house doesn't have a smell and i hate when things don't have a smell like when i can just smell like a basic smell it doesn't do it for me so what i like to do is boil water with some canela sticks with cinnamon sticks and i usually add lemon apples fruit of any kind that i have that i want to smell so right now we got some apples two cinnamon sticks some lemon and a pot of water and when this starts to boil and everything starts to break down it smells absolutely breathtaking try it also i find it extremely harder to not be on my phone when i'm like in my house for real so what i'm about to do is feed me and my dog i'm gonna feed us make sure we get some food in us because if we just head out we're gonna be hungry and i'm gonna have to buy food and i have food at home prepared so what i'm gonna do get dressed feed us and then i'm gonna go to try these donuts um for my birthday i tried oli bully donuts but there was a spot that i didn't go to called jd flannels so i want to go try jd flannels donuts and this spot is actually by the beach as well so it's like a win-win um get to go try some donuts and then also go to the beach now the thing about my dog is he can be in the sand he can be in the sand i just gotta wipe his paws afterwards so we're gonna go trying to head out right about now so I can beat like the school traffic and I also want to be at the beach when like no one's really there so we're gonna go do that and then yeah I'll be documenting this because I don't know something about just being in the house like boy, what else am I gonna do like you're more tempted to be on your phone so I want to go out explore be in nature actually like experience the day not like sitting in my house on my phone so that's what we're gonna do and yeah super excited let's go eat something and then head out because yeah also, I do have homework. All I gotta do is watch a movie. I have about an hour left of the movie, which I can come back and do that later. I'm not really stressing about it because I've been doing, like I've been started this assignment since last week. So I have some leeway to go enjoy my day, bro. Like, let's go. So actually, 
Come. Alright, so I'm probably gonna whip my dog up some levels. Ooh, my cinnamon apple. It smells good in here. Okay. So yeah, I'm gonna whip my dog up some levels. And to meanwhile, I'm gonna charge the Tesla. As you know, you know. Now I got these Heelys. I wanna ride them. Dang. That moment when you wanna charge the Tesla, but the Tesla's backwards. I'll be back. All right, so as I was doing all this, um, I was speaking to uh, the BMW services. So I don't know if you guys know, but my car's been having issues. We fixed something, and then another issue will arise. So it's just like we're tired of this car. So basically, I need, I'm going to trade in my car, but I have to. There's no other option. I need to trade in my car. Um, yeah, it's absolutely wild. Like, there's a part that's messed up. It had a recall on it, but there's no open recalls for my car, so they can't fix it. And... My mechanic is like, you just need to get another car because the repairs are going to be so much money that it's like you can literally pay monthly payments for another car. You know what I mean? Like, it's not worth it. So, yeah, we've already put like 2K into my car and I don't have warranty anymore. So it's just tough. So, yeah, uh, I'm over here like I'm going to go to this to the finals. But um, I don't know, girl, I wanted to go do my little J finals. Yeah, I wanted to go out and just stuff, but girl. I'm going to have to go pick up my car because he said he fixed it up enough to where I can drive it a short distance. But I can't drive it anymore. Like, it's not drivable for a long distance. So. Yeah. I think it's dark in here. But, yeah. I'll see if I end up going to get donuts. I did honestly have a piece of cake last night too, so I'm like, I don't even know if I need a donut right now. I'm making spaghetti and meatballs. But, I'm probably gonna go to the gym. Post office and gym. I had plans. But so did God. God was like, boy, you better go to the gym. <clears throat> because if I go to get donuts right now and go to the beach, I'm going to be late. I mean, like, I'm going to be stuck in traffic. So I think I'm going to just go to the gym. And I got to see about my car. So... not on my phone I did use my phone to google something I'm just being honest but yeah to call um I don't know what's gonna happen with my car bro I don't even wanna create scenarios because what if it don't go like that I'ma just let God this food and make it a nourishment to my body I'm sorry I keep forgetting midway I don't pause before I eat I'm gonna get back into that I appreciate this food that you love me with this blessing and I know it's gonna do what it has to do to my body thank you I'm just not praying All right. Do you ever violently eat spaghetti? 
あるよ Today's my rest day, technically, but I'm still gonna go to the gym. Cause I need to get out and do something. <coughs> I've been going to parks. See, the gym though is like indoors, but I like getting the actual like outdoor. But then to be honest, when it's hot like this, <coughs> it's like 80 degrees, and when the sun is out completely, if I do go to a park, I'm in the shade. So it's not like it's not like I'm indirect. So I'm like. I'm in indirect, so I'm like not direct. So the spaghetti, that was kind of sad. There wasn't a lot of sauce. Cause I cooked down the sauce, so it like it's very concentrated. But because of that, you don't need a lot. Cause it has so much flavor. And the meatballs are also seasoned. Like, they coated the noodles just enough. But it's not like super wet, you know? Very good. These are my favorite glasses, yeah. Alright. So I'm gonna grab my backpack and then get ready. So I'm about to head to the gym. I'll record my workout for y'all. I don't know about my whole workout, but I'll record some of it. But yeah, these are my favorite glasses, bro. They're just so firme. Firme. So, first thing I'm about to do is go to the post office to deliver a package to my niece. I got some, what's it called? What is it called? Beyonce's tour? What was her world tour called? Renaissance, the Renaissance tour. So, also y'all, have you ever felt tubby? But embrace the tubbiness, it's okay to be tubby. That's not endorsing. Oh my god. Like I feel like I'm tubby. Like I have a little I have a little a little tubby, you know? Like I'm not like super ripped six pack. And that's cool man. Normalize a little being a little tubby, man. I'm tubby, my dog tubby. You know what I'm saying? It's could be tubby, bro. I feel like we need a little bit of tubbiness on us, bro. It's gonna get cold. But I'm still healthy though. That's all that matters. So Let's get into it. I guess I'm wearing glasses because when the sun is out, it's the only time I could even wear these. <laughs>
Trio. I feel like Trio, but my name not Dro. Tell me the lie, cause I am a goat. I get that money, then go on vacation. You get that money and spend it on drugs. I get that money, then get my girl hugs. I get that money, then get my mom food. I'll tell you about something, you know I rule. I I'm the realest nigga out. Truth be told, I'm the realest nigga out. Truth be told, I ain't a nigga at all. Truth be told, trust in me, no doubt. Truth be told, I'ma do it real good. Truth be told, I ain't really from the hood. Truth be told, I'm from LBC or LA, whatever that's closest to me. I feel like I'm everywhere because I'm always outside. Anybody wanna pull up, okay, just slide. You that I got enough time. I cannot promise you that I got enough time. Sometimes I just feel too hype. Sometimes I just feel too right. Sometimes I feel like I'm dying. Sometimes I feel like I'm trying. Sometimes I feel like I'm dying. When I feel dead, I just pray to God. Told her to make me feel alive. I don't know if God is a woman or a man, but there's some things we don't understand. I know that I'm gonna get that money, get that band. If I can do it, then you can't do it. Choke like a ram Yeah, she's so wet like a dam Take my hand Alright, yo What up, what up? Alright, yo I had a cool workout The stuff I did I recorded, like, my warm-ups but for my other stuff, I was just focused. I wasn't like on my camera. <sighs> Somebody had came when I was recording, so as y'all saw. But uh, yeah, I'm kind of, I'm kind of gassed. I think I'm just hungry. It's 3:30, and I only had one meal. I've been waking up earlier and eating more, so I feel like I'm kind of fatigued. Um, so next step is go get some grub. I was gonna go to Trader Joe's, then go home, but that's honestly doing a lot. I need food now. So either I'm going to go to the crib or I'm going to go to In-N-Out. I haven't had In-N-Out in a while. So I'm, I'm going to see what I eat and then I'll update y'all. Alright, yo. We have made it to In-N-Out. I'm in the drive-thru right now. But yeah, I'm finna, I'm finna demolish this. I haven't had In-N-Out in so long. I've been wanting to go, but I'll be like, nah, 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 nah. Today's the day I'm getting In-N-Out, bro. I've been cooking at home. Like, I cook all my meals, you know what I'm saying? But today is Friday. It's a chill day. I went to the gym. I'm hungry, like my stomach is touching my back, which means I'm, I'm starving. So we're about to get some grub. I'm gonna get a three by two low salt, light salt, because they be salting up them patties and then I get hypertension. So we're gonna do low salt fries, whole grilled onions on it. Should I get animal style fries? I'm kind of feeling like a big bag. Nah. Y'all will hear my order right now. I'm not gonna lie, I'm probably gonna go on YouTube on the Tesla screen. Watch the video when I park or something. I'm excited. I'm tired. I got an assignment to do today. And yeah. Hello, I'm pretty good. You? Pretty good. What can I get cool, cool. Uh, let me do a three by two. Okay. So three patties, two meat. And can I get like light salt on the patties if that's possible? Of course. Would you like um, onions? Uh, grilled onions, please. Can I get the whole ones, like the whole grilled onion? Is that a grilled? Okay. Yeah, and then just to order fries, and that'll be it. No drinks today. Uh, just a cup of ice water. Well, ice water. It's yeah. Gonna be a three by two over onion, light salt, fried mm -hmm. water to go. It's gonna be ten forty, sir. Thank I got you. a car up next there. Way. Yeah, next one. All right. Thank you. I don't know why it blacked out, but I'm finna get my grub. I'll show y'all when I get it, but bye. So happy right now, y'all. We got the goods. I'm literally about to demolish this, so. The fries look super fresh.
fries are salty. Which is why I got the burger no salt. Or light salt on the burger. Look at that. Take a second. Thank you, God, for this food. It looks absolutely amazing. I appreciate you for providing this for me and just giving me the fuel that I need, especially after that workout. And every day, because I never starve any day. Whenever I'm hungry, you always provide food for me. Uh, so I don't I don't starve or I'm not hungry for long. Thank you, Lord. And just now I pray, man. Got the whole girl hanging on there. Patties are charred. This is busted. Let's try it. Mmm. Mm -hmm. It's so good with light salt. It'd be too salty sometimes. Mmm. In and out, just go to. When the quality is bomb, it's good. I've never been to this location. All right. Mm. Let's get into it. But yeah, I'm gonna smack this. Go home. Shower. Probably finish my homework. I'm supposed to get my car today. I'm not. I ain't finna ask nobody to take me. I mean, you can't. I can't take myself to go pick it up. So it's gonna stay there till Monday. Unless something changes. Bro, I'm demolishing this burger. Mm -hmm. Am I just big or is this tiny? Mm. I'm not complaining. I think I'm just hungry. You know like when you're not that hungry? Your food... Seems like it's so much because you're not hungry. But when you're hungry, you're like, that's it. You know? Mm. Really good. I thought that was not a lot of food because I was hungry. Like the first couple bites I was taking were ginormous. I was like, bro, I'm finna kill this burger in one bite. But nah, it was a lot of food. I'm full. Burger, 10 out of 10. The fries, were like a solid. The fries were a six, they were too hard. Like, like crispy hard, like chips, like they overcooked them. I like my fries a little crispy, but I low-key like my fries soggy, where you pick them up and they have crisp, but like the inside is like, ugh, like soggy. I love that. And there was no soggy fries. I was sad. But the burger was a 10 out of 10. Got that complimentary ice water. But yeah, I need, I low-key need to go to Trader Joe's. But it's like time is. it's four o'clock. Mm, I'm gonna go home. I might go back out later. 
but no, no. Probably be traffic time. Mm -mm. Let me go home. I'm not afraid I'm going home. That food is good. Thank God. <clears throat> what up, y'all? Dang, it looks mad crusty in here. Anyways, that's just, is that how it looks in here? That's just the lighting. Um, I have used my phone, I'm not gonna lie. I was on my bed watching this movie I had to watch for school, but I've been watching YouTube videos though throughout the day, so I'm gonna throw that in there. But honestly, this whole challenge thing was to get off YouTube, but like, I just haven't. But I haven't been on Instagram all day, so uh, I feel like it's easier for me just to not go on Instagram, but YouTube is like my social media of choice, if you will. I'm not gonna say drug of choice, but when it comes to social media, it is. I'm tired, bro. I've been sleeping earlier and I love it. Then I get to wake up earlier and I actually feel like a normal human. And then I actually get done with my like, chores early. I went to the gym, as y'all seen. My legs are fried. I walked today and it I felt it. My legs are tired, bro. Because I ran yesterday. And I also ran the day before yesterday. I did sprints, actually. And I did legs. And did squats yesterday. Like, body weight squats, but still. The boy is tired. But I want to work on music before I go to sleep, so. I'm probably going to go do that. And <clears throat> just kick it. You know what I'm saying? Do any fun endeavors I want to do for the end of the night. And then I'm going to go to sleep pretty much. Probably going to eat a piece of cake and go to sleep. Or ice cream or something. Some dessert. I had this Hagen dazs coffee ice cream. Christian, get Hagen dazs Hagen dazs Get a little thing of Hagen dazs coffee ice cream, bro. It's so good. Coffee ice cream in general is so good. If you love me, you want you would get me coffee ice cream. Trader Joe's honestly has a really good coffee ice cream too. I might write that down on my list to get some when I go to Trader Joe's actually. Cause Trader Joe's one is budget friendly. I think it has like toffee caramel or something. Cause Hagen dazs can be expensive, but it's so good. Oh my God, I got it from the pantry. I be getting pantry stuff like twice a month. You know, like the pantry where you go and they give you free food, free clothes, all that. It's a blessing. Um, it's a blessing. So they give me the ones around here. My mom's, my mom has a pantry, like a church ministry and they give her food. They give a lot of meats, uh, things of that sort. The one, the ones over here, in the SGV, they give more produce, but there is a one location that does give meat and I'm probably gonna go to next week. You know what I mean? Like some just, it's really random because they get stuff that stores just have excess of or it's about to go bad, so they freeze it or they give it to you so it doesn't go bad or whatever. And yeah, but they don't really give a lot of meat, which is fine because they gave me so much produce that all I had to do was then go to the grocery store and buy meat, protein, bought beans, bought, bunch of protein salmon blah 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 to eat so that's what i've been doing for this week but yeah i love doing stuff like that too just going to pantries you know what i'm saying they really do give out good stuff like whether that's just a bag of beans i can make pencil beans eat that for the week like they give me some milk give me six eggs i can cook that up for rico like it'd be helping they give me squash bell peppers i made a little veggie stir fry um, they gave me a veggie stir fry pack from like Albertsons. So all I had to do was buy a steak, ate that with some veggies. And I had like three servings of veggies. I ate veggies with chicken yesterday, veggies with salmon and beans today. So yeah, I'm so blessed to have a pantry and like get the resources. Like sometimes I feel like, oh, you can make it work. Like, why are you going to the pantry? Like, you know what I mean? But at the end of the day, like <clears throat> I'm a college student <coughs> and I don't have a, I don't have an income that's like, crazy crazy where i can just blast like you know what i mean like i still do think about the expenses like i could make it work with the money that i do get but it's like you know and also i feel like i'm doing it at the community good because a lot of the stuff that i get was going to be thrown away anyway so like it's not like i'm stealing food or something like that like i'm literally getting food they're going to throw away or donate you know what i mean so and it's not like they don't have enough for the uh, not hundreds, maybe like, I'd say maybe like a hundred cars line up 
each time that I'm there or more, but they have enough, you know what I'm saying? All the stores, imagine in the surrounding cities, give all the stuff they have, whether that's Albertson, Sprout, Shedder Droz, even Walmart, like Sparta Final gives stuff. Uh, just all those surrounding stores, even schools, right? Like schools that make lunches for kids, they give like the leftover little fruit cups and things of that sort. Um, distribution centers, they have a bunch of shelled nuts, raisins, like perishable items, perishable goods, or non-perishable items and things like that. Canned goods, I get a bunch of, I got black beans from Vons, canned black beans from Vons. I get um, unsweetened pumpkin that I give to Rico. This pumpkin has a lot of vitamin A or K, I believe. Um, what else do they give? Garbanzo beans, I just put that in some ground turkey with some bell peppers that they gave. Um, see what I'm saying? Like, I just, it's not like it has to create the whole meal, but it helps. You know, they gave me yogurts from um, Vons or Albuchens. I give that to Rico on the side. I eat that. They gave me a whole case of watermelon from Vons or Albuchens. A whole cake, like I said, a whole German chocolate cake from Albertsons. Like, and these are good stores too. Like, I'm, I am picky with the stores that I like actually get like produce and stuff like that from, or produce or food, whatever. Um, I'll eat certain things from Walmart, but then certain things I won't eat from Walmart. But like, pretty much everything at Albertsons, Vons is a go, Sprouts is a go, Trader Joe's is a go. Um, yeah, just the quality of the food tends to be higher at those stores. Clearly, though, like, stores have levels to them, like. You're not gonna get the same quality meat at Walmart that you're gonna get at Albertsons or Sprouts. Like it's just what it is. Like honestly, Albertsons meat is honestly, yeah, it's decent. But I feel like the best is like Sprouts, Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's probably has the best meat quality ever. Mm -hmm. I said what I said. Their steaks, their salmon, absolutely beautiful. All the steaks that they have on display are marbled to perfection. <sighs> I love Trader Joe's. I need to go. I haven't went in like. I want to say almost a month and I can tell I literally have a Trader Joe's list written down because like I write the name of the stores that I want to shop at and then I create the list for that store and like I'll just rotate right like if I went to Sprouts last week I'm not going to go to Sprouts again this week for my groceries like I'll probably go to Costco or if I don't go to Costco I'll go to Trader Joe's or if I don't go to Trader Joe's I'll go to like Spy like uh, Stater Bros or something like that so I just went to Stater Bros I went to Costco a while ago so next up on the list Trader Joe's I got chicken breast, oil, broccoli, veg, coffee, ice cream, and I'll see whatever else is in the budget for us to get. I just love going to Trader Joe's. It's the vibe. But yeah, I'm going to go feed my bunny, and then I just yap to y'all for a while, but I'm going to go feed my bunny and then hook my computer up and just have some fun, wind down a bit, you know what I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying, I'm saying. She's a pretty, okay, I'm going to go to sleep. I mean, I'm going to go give my bunny some food because I heard him I heard footsteps of a bunny oh they have a lot of news um also my car but I'll save that for a later date because I don't even know what's gonna happen with it but um, she's in the shop still she's fixed but let's just say she's not fixed enough to drive ever again unless some serious work happens and I'm not paying for that serious work it's giving about seven thousand, eight thousand dollars to fix her. Get a new car, or not, or no car at all. I'll walk. How about that?